everyone, this is Travelito welcoming you in this new vlog featuring Conrad Dubai. Just recently, we featured Conrad Manila in the Philippines. For those of you who missed it, please check it out. From Conrad Manila, another Conrad Hotel is inviting you right here in Dubai, United Arab Emirates or UAE. Conrad Dubai is located along Sheikh Zayed Highway and just right in front of the Red Line Metro Station of World Trade Center. For those of you who are attending convention in World Trade Center and looking for a luxury hotel at the same time wants to save time traveling and avoiding traffic, Conrad Dubai can be on the top of your list to consider. As you can see, their lobby is massive. There are several seats that you can choose whichever is the most convenient for you. This is the first room and I'm going to show you the features and the view from this room. By using your keycard, you can open this room and some of the operations and services that you require from this room can be done through digital panel and I'll show it to you in a while. This is the storage area of this room and it is big enough to accommodate all your luggages. And this is the cupboard where you can hang your clothes. There are several hangers available for you. Bathroom is there as well. Disposable slippers and if you need to shine your shoes, there are some items that you can use from here. Aside from that, there are also a laundry bag and laundry request form just in case you want a laundry service from the hotel. This is a toilet area with bidet toilet and also handheld bidet spray. Over here there are two wash basins so two people can use it at the same time. Some of the toiletries and dental kit are also here. If you noticed, only glass wall that separates the bedroom and the bathroom. This layout is becoming popular in modern or new hotels. I appreciate comments about uh, this layout. What do you think about this layout if you are the one who will be staying in this room? However, don't worry with your privacy because using this remote, you can roll down the blind, just press arrow down and then there's also arrow up from this remote where you can roll up the blind another interesting feature in this bathroom is you can watch movie while you are in the bathtub or taking your shower. This simple remote which has only four buttons can help you operate this. You just need to switch it on. However, you can only mute, increase or decrease the volume from this remote. It does not have the full functionality of the regular television remote. This screen is linked to the television in the bedroom so while because it is switched off then we couldn't see anything from the screen so when I switch it on this is how it looks like. I just dimmed the light as well so that we can have a better view. Right next to the bathtub is the walk-in shower. 
and as you can see it's full glass door and uh, also there's a little bit of glass wall and on the flooring if you can see the drainage is in between so you can avoid water from spilling out from the bathroom and missing it up from outside and in this bathroom you will see rain shower and of course the handheld shower then of course you have the option of cold and uh, hot shower and this one if in case you don't know this is a clothes line which you can use for wet clothes you can just hang it here or soil clothes especially right after you come from swimming you can just hang it there and then once you're done you can just remove it and put it back similar to Conrad Manella they are using the same brand of shampoo conditioner bath gel bath soap and behind this you can see the carton the black one that is loofah in this cupboard you will see your iron iron board your luggage tray if your storage area is full then you can use uh, your luggage tray you can put your luggage on the top of it and also there's a small shelf under this cupboard which you can use as well and on the top you will find your safe box and now let's see the bedroom itself so as you can see you have flat screen tv you have a working area with your table and chair it has two beds two single beds your alarm clock and you can turn on radio and FM or AM radio station from there as well. Over here is your sitting area which you can take your coffee or even for your meal. here you will find your tea bags coffee capsules sugar milk cup water and your coffee machine over here you will find a sewing kit and also hair dryer or some called it as blower Let's see what's inside the sewing kit. Let me show it to you. Inside are needles along with their individual threads and on different colors as well as a safety pin. And let's see what is in their mini bar. So here you will find your coffee cup wine wine glasses and water glasses over here you will find nuts sweets like chocolates and also water kettle and in the other side you will find as well your ice bucket and if you can see in the right side there's a paper there that is the uh, mini bar menu along with the prices
let's see what is in their mini bar fridge over here you will see some sodas you can find energy drinks beer wine water you have juices and some other alcoholic beverages another interesting part of this room in this panel you can control the light you can switch it on and off you can put do not disturb you can also put um, makeup room or request a makeup room and you can control the opening and closing of your window curtain this control panel is very handy you can just pull it up from your side table and manipulate your light your curtain whatever you need to do you don't need to stand up and do that this panel itself will do it for you and let me show you how to use this control panel with the curtain as you can see there are two types of curtain in this room there is like one in front which is they call as night curtain and then the one on the back side is the day curtain you just need to long press the button and the curtain will open or another long press and then it will close. It's the same way you need to control it for both night and day curtain. This room is a connecting room and it is separated with two doors. So each door has its own lock. So if you want privacy, you can just lock it. And this room is very much ideal for family and friends. You just need to request it from reservation team or front office team. They will allocate the room. Though it is subject to availability upon your arrival, but at least if they know it, they can anticipate and they can at least block the room for you. The only difference of this room is the bed. It has a king size bed, while the other one has two single beds. Also, the location of the bathroom this room, the bathroom is on the right side, while the other one is on the left side with regards to the view, facilities, amenities, the size of the room, all are the same. are facing the Sheikh Zayed Road. The one that we are seeing right now is the World Trade Center and the World Trade Metro Station. So if you are looking for a luxury hotel next to the Exhibition Center and also to the Metro Station that links to all the major stations in Dubai, then Conrad Dubai is the best place and ideal place for you to consider. This is the third room and the difference of this room from the other two is the view. This room is called Deluxe Sea View. This room has the best view for the fireworks display of Palm Jumeirah and Burj Al Arab during New Year. Guys, this is just the first part of my vlog. Watch out on my next vlog where I'm going to show you the executive lounge where we enjoyed the happy hour. Also, Balar restaurant for their breakfast. We went also to Kempo restaurant, which is their Korean restaurant. And also, I'm going to show you their swimming pool, which looks like a forest. And also the gym, as well as their meditation area for those of you who wants to go for yoga. Thank you once again for watching. Please subscribe, follow, like, and share. And if you have some comments, just leave your comments and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. 
And once again, this is Travelito and thank you for sticking around. <laughs>